morning friends it's Tracy and Violet and Randall one of his friends just flew over said good morning too but I didn't have you guys on from Nova Scotia living it's about quarter to seven and yeah we're just going for our walk I feel a sneeze coming on Violet what are you doing oh now you're having to pee so yeah, it's supposed to be the high of minus 1, low of minus 10 or something today. Right now it's minus 1. It's not that cold, so I didn't bother with her jacket. Um, if it was raining or something, I would, so she doesn't get all wet. But when I came out, there was a cat. I don't know whose cat. It's over there by the compost, but she didn't see it. She might scent, smell it, but it took off. It took off. So, anyways, we're just going to our thing. I'm thinking I'm going to town today, so I'm giving myself that little pep talk I talked about the other day. Not yesterday, the day before. Tomorrow's Valentine's Day. Tomorrow's our strawberry social. And I need some real fresh strawberries, which will probably cost an arm and a leg. But I need them, because we're going to dip them in chocolate and make them all pretty. I hear ya. While I'm in town, I was looking up what stuff crows eat and what things squirrels and different birds eat. So I want to get some unsalted peanuts. And yeah, I just want to look for some things. I want to look for some things. If I feel like I can do it, I'm going to do it. I'm going to bloody well do it. That's what I'm going to do. Whether I buy stuff or not, I'm going to go look at stuff. But, anyways, yeah, I see ya. Yeah, I was looking up a website, how to befriend a crow. Just being, you know, going down that rabbit hole. And keep your yard with less distractions. I'm thinking, oh, that's kind of impossible. Well, right now, you know, but when the kids are all out, but... They can be friendly birds. They're not, don't expect to be able to tame them and be pets or anything. And that's not what I was thinking. But I'd like for him to not be scared to come up and just stop closer to me. And uh, I guess they, they're omnivores. They eat fruits and vegetables and meat and whatever. And what else did it say? Oh, there was a whole bunch of stuff, but... Yeah, you gotta be careful because if they find something they like, they're quite insistent on returning and having more of it. But to develop a routine and all that, I'm like, well, I'm not the greatest at routines, so I'll try my best, but yeah, it was just fun to read about. Oh, boy, it's having a poop. I'll be back. I just want to show you, this is like the back of Saritha's house. She has one of those poles. I don't know if she ever gets anybody to fill those up. One of those poles with hooks. Has two bird feeders there. And she has this really cool... It must be a bird house. Never really looked that too hard at it, but... Up on a pole. Like that. Oh, sorry Violet, I'm stepping on your leash. Let me just get out from these trees. So I want to get one of those poles that can hold two bird feeders. Yeah, that must be a bird house. I don't know, but I'm going to keep my eye. And somebody said you can get things like that at the dollar store. They're not as tall. I can't imagine them being as tall, but I'm going to see what I can find. What are you smelling? All right. Enough dilly-dallying. But I just wanted to show you. This bird feeder. Oh God, I'm sorry you guys. I didn't mean to scare you. Oh. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, I scared a bunch of birds away. I thought I'd come do this <clears throat> while I could. Look, they're picking all those little things off. <clears throat> but this is... Ooh. This was full. So I brought out another cup. I'm going to fill it up. 
Now this one they don't seem too interested with. So I don't know, I'm gonna drop some of this on the ground so more stuff comes out. They must like the seeds. I don't know. Like pheasants or something might come and eat that. We'll try. I mean, it's gone damn some, but these seeds are definitely. Oh, that cover's not on good. All right, I'm back in the house. Yeah, I didn't think that there'd be any. I don't know what I was thinking, honestly. I suppose there's birds. Depends on the bird, depends on the time of day, but I hope they come back. I'm sure they will. They have to. They must, Violet. They must. Oh, I look rough. I gotta wash my face, but I just had my shot of vinegar and it was delicious. I'm just trying to tell my mind it was delicious. It was delicious. But it's only a little shot diluted in water and shoot it back. I'm gonna make a coffee. Nobody's up right now. It's 20 after 7 now. Um, yeah, we went for a little walk, not too far, and then fiddling with those bird things. I want to go into town around 8 o'clock, like I want to go in when the store's open so I can be quick. I need to get strawberries, and while I'm in there, I'm just going to do my little loop. I have to get more eggs, too, because there's no more eggs. So, yeah, we'll just, we'll figure something out. All right, I have my coffee out here. If you see my video yesterday, you know I did a good tidy out here, the dining room and the playroom. And for the most part, it's good. DB's over there on the floor, a blanket, a Nerf gun, but it can be picked up in two shakes. So I'm just gonna have my coffee. Oh, Randall, I'm gonna get you some treats. I am, now that I have that ground bird feeder. Um, I'm gonna put that, I opened that yesterday, my mind's, zigzagging but I opened uh, a friend from my sister friend Laura and it's a ground bird feeder for Randall so that's why I wanted to get some special treats for him if I can and we'll see now I also want to get soot feeder a soot feeder which I know what they are I just I've never had one they're like the square things that are I don't know you hang up anyways yeah, where was I going with that? Store's open at 8 o'clock. I'm having my coffee now. The house isn't a giant disaster, so I'm not going to worry about it. And I will uh, go in and take care of some stuff. And, yeah, we'll be good. I need to rewatch how to make a cake with a Jello mix. I know one of you guys sent, mentioned it in the thing. Some Moss family, maybe? I don't know. I'll, I'll look I'll look one up because that's what I wanted to do. I did it last year and the lady, oh God, I can't think of who it was. And it was, she was really good. Like she did a whole bunch of, she was from down south somewheres. Yeah. Anyways, I'll be back. Whew. Collard Valley Cooks. That's who I got those recipes from. I just rewatched those videos. So <sighs> I'm breathing, you guys. I'm breathing through. And I'm about to punch this feeling right in the friggin face so back off if you guys know what I'm talking about you know what I'm talking about so I'm gonna head to town Maziah just got up so she's gonna stay with Violet I'm just going to the superstore I'm not going all the way into town but it's uh, I had to come out and move the van I can't move it over like I normally would so I'm hoping I can squeeze the, through by it but anyways, we're going to go to town. I got my bags. I'm going to listen to my book. And it's just like quarter after eight now. So I should be home by nine, nine thirty, the latest. All right, guys, it's eight thirty five. I realize the store doesn't open till friggin nine o'clock. So I'm going to have to wait. I'm just going to listen to my book because I don't want to go home and have to do this whole circus all over again. I checked. When Walmart opens, that doesn't open till 
9. Canadian Tire doesn't open till 9. Dollarama doesn't open till 10. So can't really do anything. And that's all right. I'm just going to sit. I'm in the Superstore parking lot. I'm just going to sit and wait until 9 o'clock. And then I'll go in. I know that like the staff and everything's here, but I just need to wait a little bit longer. Oh, I wasn't even thinking it's Sunday. It's Sunday. Um, yeah, but at least it's not 10 o'clock because if it was, didn't open till 10, I would go home, but 25 minutes, I can do it. I can do it. All right. It's 8.59. I see people at the door unlocking the door. There's a worker that was standing outside, so maybe they're just letting them in, but it's only friggin' two minutes. They might as well leave it open for goodness sakes. They probably will. God. Takes like three people to unlock it. They must all security and stuff. Now are you gonna leave it? Leave it. Come on, leave it. I'll see if they go over to the other door to unlock it. I don't know. That's the guy that works in the meat deli. Oh, there's people walking over. Okay, yeah, there's a few other people waiting. I've seen a couple of people go up to the door and didn't realize it was closed. But let's go. All right, I'm at where the berries are and there's no friggin' strawberries. What's going on here? Blueberries, raspberries, blackberries. But no strawberries. What the heck? Alright, I know they'll have frozen strawberries, but I wanted some fresh strawberries for goodness sakes. Oh, Lord. I already have two bags of frozen strawberries at home. But, okay, while I'm here, I'm going to see if I can find some unsalted peanuts. I wonder if they like the ones that are in the shells. Like, do they like to try to take them out? There's peanuts. That looks like they must be salted. Yeah, salted. Unsalted. 99 cents for 100 G, 100 grams. That must be what this is. I'll get two of those. I don't want to buy a bunch of other things like seeds and stuff until I know. Like would they eat pumpkin seeds and stuff? I don't know. I should have did more research. But now let's go over to this bakery hodgepodge. <sighs> no, nothing's really popping out to me. Here's some hamburger. Still, like, I'd be paying seven something. I might get a couple packs, though. There's one for ten. Alright, let's see over here. Uh, yeah, that's a big roast. Yeah, I don't know. A little steak, fourteen nineteen, so seven something. Maybe I'll get that for my husband. Oh, there's more hamburger over here. Yeah, that's a good price, like nine nineteen, so fifty percent off of that. Nine fifty. Yeah, that's pretty good. Some sausages. I don't need any of those. Work shoulder blade roast. Two little chicken breasts. Seventeen sixty-eight. No, thank you. All right. Well. Let's go see if these hodgepodges have been refilled. Hard to say. Uh, I don't know. Oh. 
see. Look, they have all these, but they're lightly seasoned, delicately seasoned. I wonder if those would work. I don't know. I better not chance it because I don't want to hurt them. There's a cupcake holder. Yeah. Not too much. Not too much. Right, I wasn't planning on it, but then I thought I'd go to the dollar store that doesn't open 10. It's quarter two. But I have a $25 gift certificate for Canadian Tire, so I might as well go check out the bird section, right? We'll see. All right. Look at these beauties. Jeepers. Oh, look. They have peanuts already. Easy pickings. Well, dang it. Gosh, they're beautiful. Oh, I want them all. I want every single one of them. But I can't do that, of course. I'm not going to get any hummingbird feeders now because there's none out. Look at that big kahuna. I like those ones too, and then you can put soot. That's 60 bucks. Oh, there's soot there. Suet, soot. Oh. There is, what is that? Does that come with the thing? That's in French. Oh, just a minute. Oh, it's 15 packs of that, those suet things for $24.99. That would take my gift card, but then I'd need a holder, right? And I know you can make your own. I'm just not at that level yet. Can you just buy holders? Oh, there's one. That would hold two of them. Double suit feeder. Well. I don't know. I just don't know. Look at that cute little hummingbird feeder. It's like a mason jar. Oh. Lovely, lovely. I was looking on Facebook last night, you know, people that build them, and there's some real beauties out there, but they just... I understand you gotta charge for your labor and supplies, and it looks beautiful, but... At some point, I'll, I'll do that. I would really like one of these so I could put bird food and the soot in it. That one's 62. Why is that 159? That's a, just, that's bamboo and that's cedar, I guess. But, no, that's what I'm gravitating towards, but I can't. Tracy, control yourself. Just control yourself. Just control yourself. That's... There's 10 in that pack. There's 15 in that pack for the same price. Different brands. But I'd have to go for the bigger pack. I think that's what I'll do. And then I'll just pay for this, which is $10.99. And that should be good. That should be good. But I'm glad I know about this. Because I got those peanuts today. But, yeah. I'll keep that in mind. And then there's all this other bird food. Yeah. All right, friends, it's quarter to 11. I just got home. The fire's pumping. It's nice and warm in here. Maze made the fire for me. Thanks, Maze. <laughs> Anyways, I'll show you what I got at the superstore. So this steak was 50% off. I couldn't get it to scan, so they gave it to me because they couldn't get it to scan either. So I got this free steak. Awesome. Um... I got a graham cracker crumb pie crust. I know I can make my own, but I just thought it was $1.99 and it'll just save me a few extra steps for a strawberry social dessert. So, so that, I was thinking about that, that is for. Yeah, that's the same kind of stuff, but I'm going to use that for something else. Yeah, but can you tell them what to do? Uh, well, not right now. I got some feminine care products. 
I got this baby shampoo for a little basket I'm going to put together this spring. Uh, some whipped cream, some graham cracker crumbs, or I think that's what it is. Yeah, honey made crumbs. I don't know. Um, four things of cream cheese. I'm going to sit out because I need to make something with that. I got those two things of roasted unsalted peanuts, two things of strawberry jello, three things of chocolate chips. I just realized this is Hershey's and the other two are President's Choice, but they were all in the same. Somebody must have just mixed it up and I didn't notice. I got two things of icing sugar, four bags of frozen strawberries because they didn't have any fresh. We're going to have this for supper tonight, some taco, soft tacos. I got some strawberry lemonade for tomorrow some eggs and I got one two three four five six seven things of hamburger yep I'm excited 9 19 14 39 9 50 15 72 10 27 13 31 and 10 93 but I paid 50% off all those prices and then I got some songbird cardinal wild bird seed they're like little sunflower seeds only. They're not sunflower seeds, I don't think. They're smaller. And then I got this. Uh, I don't know how to say that. Niger uh, bird feed. It's little teeny tiny things. So we're going to try that. And then I got this tube bird feeder yeah, at Superstore. That's, yeah, we'll put something in there. i got to figure out what yet. Yeah, but this is what I got. Um, I'm excited. I'll put this away and I'll show you what I got at the dollar store. Mm. All right. So you've seen what I got at Canadian Tire, that suet stuff in this feeder. So, and I got peanuts at the superstore. The dollar store, I got some plain bagels and the, the rest of the stuff. I got one of these like that but it's just one for four dollars I got this which I thought was cool I've never seen there before they're hanging ones one's like a bird bath and one's a bird feeder it's like mesh on the bottom and I don't know if there's yeah there's the chains with it so that's good that for four dollars and that couldn't find any of those hooks I know they're probably at some dollar stores dollaramas but they weren't at this one at least not now so that sucks. They probably had some at Canadian Tire, but I didn't think to look. Dang it. I got another one of these stick to the window ones. I got one the other day. So yeah, it's over there. So I got another one of those. Um, I, I'm i trying to jimmy rig something up. Like I could use this rope, which I know isn't the best. I was hoping to find a big spool of wire, but to hang up some of this stuff out in front of the house somewhere. Because I know a squirrel can chew through that. But I'm going to do this anyways until I can get a different fix. But I got some of this all-purpose rope. We're going to try that. And then the stuff I got at the Superstore you've seen. So I got a nice little haul. And I read the little thing. We took the sticker stuff off of here. And this is for wild bird seed. And this. The Niger kind. I don't know if I'm saying that right. but So I'm going to fill it with this this songbird and cardinal I'll just put it in a different a different bird feeder at some point of <sighs> I'll probably put most of that bag in this thing and yeah maze is itching to do this so we'll get set up and we'll fill up this tall skinny one yeah just a sec oh I just peeked out and there was four or five blue jays getting into that one bird feeder but maybe they see me in the window uh, yeah oh well let's let's do this maze okay what should we do first I don't know. do you want to do this tall skinny one or do you want to do the cages I think I want to do the cages the cage match yeah Is it the cage match maze Okay, we've got to open this. I am not familiar with this stuff at all. I know it comes out in a brick. Wait, those bricks? Well, let's see. So, is that just a block? It's like. So, there's 15 in here. 
chunked up of like gold food. Yeah. So I'm gonna be nibble off of that. So we'll need three of them. Like that. So all these. I so think see we need... what's in it. Ingredients. Rendered beef fat, cut corn, uh, red milo, white millet, black oil seed sunflower. So not for human consumption. Probably wouldn't kill you, but don't take a bite out of this means. Yeah, but I think we need one for this. Yeah, we do. Alright, let's move this over. But we need two for that because I see two All right. slots. So see how this opens. Can you no. sit down so they can no, see? No, you can't open it. See? Oh. It's holding it down. So I think we need to go from the side. But oh, you are right. You are one smart feller. He oh. felt smart. I was trying to open it from there, but it's hard to do that. Oh, it opens like a door. You can't see against my... opens like that. Okay. Okay, can I put it in? Well, we got to take it out of the plastic. Yeah, I know. Let me poke a hole. So and then you can put it in. Because you, you don't want fat, but I kind of want it like that. Because I'm I know you like fat. fat. You are a fat lover. Um, yeah. Oh, it's kind of greasy. Put some grease fat. in your hair, maybe. I'll put it in. You can put it in. Just let me get it out. Oh, where's our tray? Wait, it's breaking on the side. I know. We need our tray. Everybody needs a tra good tray in their life. Ugh. All right. Let's put. Okay. Can you shut the door? Excellent. All right. Let's do the other side. Oh, well, you have it on your nail. I know. Little white that up. I won't do that. Just horsing around with you. I guess we can make this with enough fat that we drain off in this house. I just never, never thought of it. That might have to be something we'll do someday, Maze. Yeah. But we'll, we need to keep that off to see what they use. All right. You put it in. That one it looks big, I think. You think it's big old? Yeah. Know. I think it's big old. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's pretty cool. Yeah. And then you just have to hang it up like that. And no, we're not, I don't know what we're kind not of birds. Done. We're, not done. we're not done. No, we're not. Now, how do we open that one? I don't know. Let me see. You figure it out Wait. while I open this. There's a little slot right there. We might have to... Get that open. I don't know. Wait, but that's holding it down. Wait, I know how to open it, I think. Oh! I hit myself. <laughs> oh, I know. But I, I know I know how to do it. Okay. Let's get it out of this. I figured it out. You did. And I hit my nose at the same time. Give it the old heave ho. Maybe turn it around the other way. Yeah, like that. It's really greasy. Yeah, we'll push it down. There. Oh, let's just put that on top. Yeah. You can see the peas and stuff. Hmm. No. Shut it up for us. We've got to make sure it's good and tight. Yeah. I'll hold it. You give it a push. Is that it? No. Let's go around that way. Now, let's see. There. We'll wait for Misha. And then we can go out and try to figure it out. I'm going to tie some ropes. And then me and Misha can do that because I think that one will Yeah, Misha will probably want to do something. So we should wait for her. I think? think I mean, Misha should do that one. Mm. Anthony. Anthony. Yeah, when Misha gets up, um, well, gets downstairs. We'll set that up. So I need to wash my hands. They're all greasy. 
and I'll be right back. Yeah, you should wash your hands too. Okay, Misha's made her appearance. I've got to scooch over. Hold on, Mace, because I'm moving the chair. Hold it, hold it. Scooch right over here, Misha. So, we're going to put the Niger stuff in there. this kind of seed. So we got Laura's um, ground bird peel. We're going to put on the little picnic table. Okay, don't wiggle the table, Mace. i got to get a scoop. <clears throat> Cute, isn't it? Ouch. I don't know. Is it next to you both here? Yes. Okay, Misha, you do three scoops and then Mays can do three scoops. Okay. Do you want to do a scoop now? Okay. okay. Here, I'll hold it. That's very exciting. Where's Violet? Is she getting jealous? It looks like the top of pencils. Like when you accidentally mm -hmm. take them off. That's a lot now. It's all right, it's all right. You can just smell it. Nisha, no, not so much like that. Ugh. Alright. Perfect. Okay, then you switch spots with Maze. You probably only get one or two scoops, Maze, and then you'll be full up. Oh, I'm going to get you to do this one. Yes. I'm going to put some peanuts in those ones. Where were we? Well, the squirrels like other squirrels. Well, the squirrels can help themselves too, if, as long as they don't break my bird feeders. Or the birds. I don't know on the bird feeders. There's seeds on the ground. Yeah. Oh, I'm sure if they could get into the bird feeders, they would. But they gotta eat too, right? Mom well, like that's really good. All of a sudden. Now one more little scoop. One more little scoop. Excellent. So, all right. Can I put the lid on? Yes. The lid on. I'm gonna use this one. It's time to let the lid out. All right. Mally's gonna do that, Maze. Yep. Yeah. Right. I'm gonna this. I'm gonna take this whole tray outside and just dump the Ooh. stuff that fell out Can on I the ground. That? No. Oh, Mally's gonna do that. All right, you guys can hop down so Mally can come over here and do it. Can I help with the pool? With the pool? Yeah. I don't know. Do you guys put bird baths in the? Winter, I Don't suppose. Put it out in the winter. Oh, I was thinking it would freeze. You can yeah. try it, but. The most king of ice skating! Hop down, Mace. It'll get too too cold for them, and when they get in it, it's uh, It's too cold. I need this. So you can put like some of those nuts in there, and then we'll get some of the other seeds out in the porch, like in the big buckets. Yeah. But you're gonna have to put this. But these won't fall out. No. Where'd you get these? Superstore. And then I went to Canadian Tire and they had like bags of bird peanuts. But <laughs> I didn't realize. That's good. I don't want to put them all there because I don't know how fast they'll be eaten and I don't want them to get wet. And Put more in that one. Alright. Okay, let me get the uh that's for the strawberry social tomorrow, of course. Oh. The graham cracker crust. No, don't open that juice, that's for tomorrow too. Okay. I'm making those 
dipped strawberries up there. That's the No, I could, Super Sport didn't have any. I got frozen ones, but I don't know if you could do that. No. I know. Gosh. Gosh. If Dad goes to town, maybe he'll check Sobeys. There's a cup of the other black sunflower seeds, and you can divide it between the two. I just don't want the little, yeah. Very exciting. This is just a trial. I have to find some more treats for Randall. Not sure. I don't want to get my fingers in there because the peanuts. Oh yeah, you're allergic. I am oh. allergic. I can't imagine being allergic to those. I wasn't allergic to them for most of my life. Okay. I can put the rest back in my bucket. Now, oh, you I was, I did. <laughs> Sorry. What is it? I was what trying to make one? a rope so I can throw it up over a branch. <laughs> God, I'm such an amateur. There, throw it up over a branch and then it would be like I can hang it like that. What? That? These bird feeders. Well, not all of them. I want to put this one down back so I can watch it from the kitchen. And maybe one of the suet ones. I don't know. How does these even work? Well, they probably just pick it out and then other little ones fall in. Follow those little holes. I'm an expert, so I know. Well, you're not. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I asked you and you said you didn't know. I don't know, but that's what I'm assuming. So I'm going to set you guys up in the house so you can watch us down there. I'll probably put it to some silly music because it's going to be funny trying to do this. We'll go and try to set this one up and then after I'll scout for different spots for these things. So let's do it. <laughs> Alright, we got one and it's right dead center so hopefully they don't mind the green rope hopefully it stays up and we're just gonna wait because they're probably spooked with us coming out there like that but it's starting to snow now it's supposed to start snowing at 1 and stop tomorrow afternoon at 3 so oops Is it gonna snow bad? I don't know but it's and it's pretty darn cold out there I'm not taking them down. Yeah, it's not gonna be cold up tomorrow. No, we'll check them after the storm and we'll see. There's not gonna be a storm. Yeah, we don't live in Nova Scotia. There's no storms here. <laughs> All right, we're Wait, going we're back leaving. out. I'm just gonna go out and scout someplace out for. We have three more to hang. Isaiah's not interested. Is it okay? So I want to put some out here. And I have strings in my hand. Oh, I need Violet's leash. I was using that blue leash because it's heavier to throw it up over a branch. One's going to go over here for sure. 
Misha, can you go get Violet's leash down back? I left it down there. That little, the one that Laura sent, the tabletop one, just put it there on the... That's what I'm doing. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> All that bird food that was on the picnic table is gone. So, Ooh. I'll set you guys up on the picnic table. Yeah, I will. Oh. Face me. It's not. It's facing what we're going to try to do. What? Oh, branch broken. I need to hold on to one of these holes. I need to find out what one's the longest one. No, this one. Yours is the longer one. This is, but it's not doubled up. Let me see that, Mish. I know what where you hold it. I know it's holding. Struggle, but we did it. We just have one more to hang.
Going bananas. I'm just dump the rest of this tray of stuff in. <laughs> like, oh, your boot fell off. So there's that one. <sighs> and now I just need to go cut the thing. I'll be right back. <laughs> All right, friends. Um, it's 12:41. I'm heating up some pizza bites in the microwave. Misha, Matt. Maze and Mazaya are filling up the wood box. So I'm just gonna scramble up a couple packs of hamburger for the soft tacos tonight for supper. It's only early, but I just wanna do this now. This is this is extra lean. One pack's extra lean and one pack's medium. So I'll end up straining it anyways. But the rest, I kept out one more and put it in the fridge in case my husband wants to cook that. Like sometimes he likes to just have hamburger. The rest are in the deep freezer, so, and I need to flip those things over. Uh, let me just do this quick. not to have a fire today. I can say that for sure. And I keep looking at the windows and there's no birds now. There was birds earlier this morning, but maybe because it's getting cold? Like, I don't know. I keep wanting to see them, so. Once I get used to bird watching and not the dirty kind of bird watching, I'll know kind of what their schedules are maybe. So. At least they're set. I didn't end up putting out that bird bath. I just, it would end up freezing, you know, in an hour. So. Yeah. So anyways, I'm just going to scramble this all up. And this is, they like soft shells more so than hard shells these days. So, um. They had like burrito mixes, but there was only, how many are in this one? There's 12 in this, there was only 10 burrito wraps, they're probably bigger. But I was like, no, I'll go for this one. I'm gonna do the two kits and two packs of hamburger and we're gonna do, how'd you make out, Bob? Thank you, I appreciate it. He doesn't have to lift as much as the girls just cause he's a bit smaller, a wee bit smaller, but. You're turning seven soon, then you'll have to kick it up a notch. Huh? Okay. Okay. Now I don't want to grow up. Now you don't want to grow up? You're a Toys R Us kid? Yeah. So, this is nice red hamburger. I never thought to get lettuce, and I, while I was waiting that half hour at the Superstore parking lot, I was watching like strawberry dessert videos. And there was one, I needed pretzels and I forgot to get pretzels. So I'm hoping my husband goes to town after because I'd like for him to get that. After I'm done this, I can do a bit of baking and um, cause I wanna make a strawberry cheesecake. Mally's gonna decorate it, but I'll make it. Strawberry cake. And I was thinking of making strawberry uh, Moose. Oh, oh, and I forgot to get Oreo cookies too. Jeepers. Maze, what's wrong with me? You don't need Oreo cookies. No. Anyways, we'll see. We'll see what I can muster up. I mean, I could always get Oreo cookies downtown probably. You could use bodies. Oh, Smarties, yes. Anyways, there's a bunch of really cool it's a cake desserts. 
the cake is for the strawberry social tomorrow. It's very important. Oh, because I don't like strawberries. Yeah, you don't, it's not going to be specifically strawberry. You don't have to eat any strawberries. But. I want red velvet for my daughter. You want red velvet? Or vanilla. I really want, like, white cake. I want white cake. You want white cake. What's going on with these children? You had that for your birthday. I like, uh, I know, that bottle cake. The chocolate's my favorite. Oh, the warm tortillas. Yeah. Yeah, seasoning mix. I'll add can of tomato soup to this. I don't follow the directions. Nobody can tell me what to do. Chocolate huh? is my second favorite. Chocolate is my favorite. I'm supposed to keep an eye on that. I know, I'm keeping an eye on it. Can I push it? Yes, but be push careful. Those boxes can go in the fire. push hard. Push down and twist. Yep. Mm -hmm. Oh, starting to get sleepy. But we accomplished, I say we accomplished a lot. I think we did the bird stuff. I need to slow my roll. I don't need to go berserk. There's probably an overkill when it comes to bird feeders in a yard because too much might be too much. I don't know. But so well back we have five bird feeders and then we have four, well two suet ones and two seed ones. So at least Birds will know they can come here and have something to eat and have a good feed, right, Nays? Yeah, uh, what was the bowl that went on, like, Papa's neighbors? Herbie. Not on the neighbors, on the telephone pole. I was telling these guys about Herbie, the seagull. We don't really get seagulls in our yard. We, there's seagulls around here. There's seagulls all over the place, but they don't generally come down unless they try to get into the get, compost. Like, but days. seagulls are pretty big. You usually get like blue jays. Yeah, blue jays. One time over, I don't think it was at this house, maybe it was at the other house, there was a seagull stuck in my compost. I go and uh, to take it out and there was a friggin' seagull stuck in it. It's so big like it couldn't open its wings to try to get out. Yeah, I talk about a racket. I just tipped it over. Sometimes we get raccoons stuck in the compost if it's down to the bottom. You just tip it over and they get out. But how's it coming? Good. Good. Violet's down there with the girls. We ordered two more cords of wood. I forget if I told you we're getting really low on wood down in the basement. So we ordered two more that should be here next week. Maybe this week. I don't know. Anyways, just to tide us over for the rest of the winter and then this summer we'll make sure we order a big a big lot of it and uh, get it in the basement for next winter but yeah I forget how much my 265 a cord maybe I forget something like that 285 295 I don't know I forget but it's the same guy we've got it from the past few years he's just a young young fella I don't know if my husband taught him when my husband used to teach at the high school years ago but um, I can't remember if he was a student or not. He knew him. But it's looking good. Looking good, Maze. I'm just like going around. Yeah. It's like vacuums. Yeah, like vacuums. So, anyways, when that comes, um, I don't know if we'll bother putting it down the basement. We'll just probably put a tarp over it because. We're coming up on March, and 
we still get snow in March, but we sometimes still get snow in April. Not much, but you never know. January and February and a bit of March is usually the heavier months, I find. This year has been kind of wicked. Like, we've had storm after storm after storm. It wasn't like that last year. But this is like a real winter. Want to get the things on the side of the thing that I'm missing with? Um, yeah, let's see. This is what I do. I'm just... Oh, can I play? Yeah, let me just... That, not, not, okay, not. okay, you do it, you do it. Just try not to do it too wild, because then you'll end up splashing yourself. Mom, have a nice tea lemonade? Yes. Have a lemonade? Oh. Whatever one. Okay. I like my okay. Don't do that so hard now, Maze. I'm going to get those bites out of the microwave. Thank you, ladies. for tomorrow. Oh, yeah. I need to make some biscuits. It's called the strawberry social. Yeah, yeah, yeah right. <laughs> well, you didn't make them. You didn't make them. Ooh, yet. it's fringe. Fringe, honey. Not all of it's done. See that? No, well, it's getting there, though. Right there with the like so we can get into the stuff. Yeah. yeah, I got your lunch over there, bud. Mom, when it, uh, When is what? You have to wake me up tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. Why? Yeah. What's the big deal about tomorrow? Hours. The social? Can you tell where to start? All right. Love ya. Yeah. I'll just keep an eye on it. You go over there and start eating your lunch before it gets cold. Oh, wait, wait. There's yeah. That'll cook. Because i got to strain this and stuff. Oh, Thanks no. for your help, Mace. Okay. Just breaking up some of the bigger chunks. I didn't put any seasoning in this, but I am going to put the... I can put some of the garlic pepper in there. It's weird not seasoning something. You don't want pizza bites, Nisha. What do you want? I don't a bagel. I can toast you a bagel. We've got some cream cheese. I think there's strawberry and maybe some herb and garlic. No? Yeah. Yeah, well, that's pretty well done. I'm going to strain this and. I'll be back. I'll figure out what Misha wants for lunch. It's 12:53, and then I gotta, I gotta prioritize, prioritize what I'm doing. All right, friends. I need to wipe this table off. There's little bits of bird seed on here, but um, I was just on the phone, and while I was on the phone, I was writing down recipes because I was looking for. This is from the Color Valley Green Cooking. No, call her Valley. I don't know. I'll put her channel down below. Um, but this is the strawberry cake recipe. I'm not going to use the icing like she does the icing too, but we did that last year. It was good, but it was so sweet. So sweet. That was too sweet for us. So I'll do the box cake. It's one box cake, three ounces of jello, like a box, three fourths cup of oil, half a cup of water, four eggs half a cup of strawberries, bake at 350, 30 to 35 minutes. Her strawberry cheesecake, 
one graham crust, which I bought one, um, a cup of cut strawberries, eight ounces of cream cheese, a half a stick of butter, which is a fourth cup of soft butter, three teaspoons of strawberry jello, one fourth cup of sugar, and 16 ounces of whipped topping. And then I looked up a different YouTube channel. I'll have to put that below too, I forget. But just for shortcake, I usually do like a drop biscuit. Um, like a, yeah, anyways, I, I wrote this down. Uh, the biscuits, one and a half t tablespoons of baking powder, one tablespoon of sugar, two cups of flour, one teaspoon of salt, five tablespoons of cold diced butter, a half a cup of whipped cream, one half cup of cold milk, and a uh, half a teaspoon of vanilla. And then like for the strawberry, in the strawberry shortcake is one and a half pounds of strawberries and a fourth cup of sugar, so. There's a squirrel down there at the bottom of that tree. Just chased a blue jay away. See him? I wonder if he's going to try to go over there. I don't know. Getting the droppings, maybe. Oh, he had climbed right up to it, but now he's just dropping it down and then going down at the bottom. I think his name's Harold. I'm not sure. Didn't catch it. He looks like a Harold. So, I'm following the directions that she did, not the directions that are on the cake box. And I hope it turns out. If not, I do have a second cake box. What is that? Oh. One box cake. Right there, a thing of jello. I have the oil and the water in there. I got four eggs in there. And strawberries, like to decorate the top. I don't know. I don't have any fresh strawberries, so. We'll see. I'll make the cake and I'll let Mally decide. And I think my husband will probably go to town after. And he can check Sobeys. And if not, we'll just make it work. So this is just a white, white cake. Um, I have the oven preheating at 350. And I have Linda. 9 by 13 over here so put this in put this in I really could sit and watch out my window all day long I had no idea it would be such a therapeutic thing but it is I used to have aquariums. I know somebody mentioned that. Aquariums are fun to watch. And I used to have aquariums. And I, I, I totally agree. Totally agree. All right. Don't need this because I'm not following those directions. My fire can eat it. These aren't necessarily room temperature. But I'm going with it. There's four eggs. Three-fourths cup of oil and one fourth cup of water. Put it in a greased baking thing, stick it in the oven 30 to 35 minutes till it comes away from the edge of the pan. Voila. Uh, so. Doing 
this by hand because I'm too lazy to get my mixer. So I'm going to do it until I don't see any more lumps. And I'm getting steps. An exercise. So. Don't do this. It smells like strawberries. I can tell you that much. I first put in strawberry shortcake in YouTube. Like to look up a recipe. And of course the cartoon strawberry shortcake popped up. I'm like now the recipe. It was Natasha's kitchen. The recipe I wrote down. Natasha's Kitchen. She must be very popular. She has like one point something million subscribers. So. Just mix it up. That looks pretty smooth to me. And boy, the color. You'll see when I drop it out. It's a cross between strawberry smell and hamburger smell in my kitchen. Let's do this. You see that color? Well, you can kind of see. I'll take you off so you can get a better look at it in a minute. And then this can go right in the uh, uh, dishwasher. This is like a 70s recipe. That's what she kept saying, like a 70s cake for get togethers and church functions and whatnot. One your mom used to make. So I'll get you off so you can get a better look. There. Doesn't that look pretty? Yeah, so uh, I'm not sure if this is up to snuff. Oh, there. My oven's ready. It's going to go right in. I'll put it for 30 minutes and check it. And if it needs longer, she said 30 to 35 minutes, but we'll see. My oven's kind of funny. All right, we're back to the tacos. Uh, timer's still on, 22 minutes left for the 30 minute mark. Here's that strained hamburger. I'll turn it back on. And I just want to get it all seasoned. I'll take it off the heat after and I can easily reheat it when it comes supper time. I'll still have to shred some cheese, but that's okay. Yeah. Okay. You know I'll be using my food processor for that. Yeah. What? Yeah. There's little birds out at that feeder now where the blue jay and squirrel were. They're the little ones. So that's good. But nobody's been to my new tall skinny one. I don't know how to use it. I don't know what that's for that specific kind of bird. Maybe it's the green rope that's throwing them off. Dang it. We'll see. I'm not giving up on it. I'm just opening a can of tomato soup. Usually I wouldn't put a whole one in, but I'm doing two packs of hamburger. And that's what I want to do. It's the first sharp rock and it hurt my foot. Yeah. It tends to do that. might have to add a little water to this. I don't generally, but... Water? I might have to. Why would you do that? Just, there's a lot of meat in here. Well, you ruin the flavor. No, it won't. It's chicken broth. I don't have any chicken broth up here. We don't need chicken broth. We just Beef need little... Wild. 
Just need a little. I'm not opening a beef broth either because I wouldn't use that much. I know what I'm doing. No, you don't. No, I do a little bit. There's so much water. Is it? You're crazy. Yeah, I just want to warm this up so it gets to know one another and that's done. The rest is I can warm up the tortillas, put the taco sauce in a bowl. Why warm up the tortillas? Well, you don't have to warm them up, but just to make them a little more pliable. Um, I'll get out the salsa too, just because. And I think there's sour cream left, so we'll just, it's just another version of a quesadilla only with taco meat. It's taco. It have to be made with chicken. Well, I don't know if that's 100% true or not. But Probably not, but there, 19 minutes. Take a peek. Oh, it's rising. It's rising. Um, I'm starting I, that um, cream cheese I got from the town today. I didn't put it in the fridge, so I just need one. And I have a tub of whipped topping calls for 16 ounces of whipped topping but the tub I got is one liter and I asked Google what how many ounces are in one liter and it's 33 point something so I'll only use about half of that tub and I took up some frozen strawberries stuck them did I put them in the microwave I might have just yeah. put them in a bowl I'm gonna defrost them a bit and then blitz them because um, that goes in the pie too oh, those birds they're just precious so Anyways, I'm just going to do this, I'll bring it back, and we'll do up that pie. Alright, this is a cup of strawberries. I'm going to blitz them in my food processor. I can't find my little one, so I'm going to do it in my big one. And then I'll be ready to rock with that um, cheesecake. Alright, here's the cake. So it's not quite as pretty as when you first put it in, but I'm sure on the inside it will be. But you can see it's all come away from the sides. It comes out clean. It's good. Good. Now I just need to let it cool and Matt can doctor it up to however she wants. All right, I'm trying to get this done. I'm trying. I even got my hand mixer out. Oh, I can never get you on the level. Is that better? I don't want a little too much the other way. Goodness sakes, woman. That bench that's over there is pulled out from the wall because we're still working on the floor there. All right. I know. I had seen that before. I don't know if you have seen it, but just how we were talking about those kind of documentaries. All right. Oh, can you pass me that graham cracker crust over there? So, hopefully this cream cheese got soft. I don't know if I'm supposed to bake that. I never thought of it. Am I supposed to bake it? I'm not used to those things. Oh, this is ready to use. You don't have to. I don't have to do anything. This is ready to do. So. Okay, good. That's what I like. This is eight ounces, isn't it? I think so. I think she just used one box. Mm -hmm. And then she mixed this and the butter together. So, one fourth cup, so half a stick. I'm just gonna eyeball it because you know that's what I do. I think that's about right. And this is soft butter. I have it sitting out on my camera all morning. All right, there's that. What else do I need? Well, I probably have to mix that up. I forget, I watched her video. I wonder if I should cut that, cream that cheese and butter together. Scratch, scratch, the gold is what's inside. Yeah, 
eight ounces of cream cheese, half a stick of butter. I'll cream it together and then add three teaspoons of that strawberry jello, a fourth cup of sugar, and then the whipped cream, mix it all together. Right, I forget if she did this in her stand mixer or what, but. Oh, okay, so Mally has one fourth cup of sugar here for me. And, yeah, my husband went to town, so I sent him with a little list. Well, it's on the list. <coughs> I got, I needed those pretzels, like I was telling you. We have pretzels. We have pretzels? Yeah. Where are they? I don't believe you. This is not an official teaspoon, but what you gonna do? Oh, I should call it like that now. Why do you need pretzels, Mom? To make another strawberry dessert. What strawberry dessert? Strawberries. So I blitz these. Can you get me a pasta? Yeah. yeah. I think she actually added those in last. Now that I think of it. That doesn't matter. Probably will matter, but it doesn't matter. I like to live dangerously. And then can I repeat twisties? I'm going to try to do half of this. Oh, that looks good. I could eat a whole tub of this. You don't need the other half. What? You won't need the other half. Yes. For what? Probably for the cake or something. All right, let's mix it. The cake won't need whipped cream. Yes, it will. The cake. Well, maybe. It mm. might. No, it won't. You're not eating that whole tub, Manly. It's, I'm not going to no. eat the whole tub. Now, we just put it into the thing and then we got to let it sit for a while. Well, we're going to let it sit till tomorrow. And you can either decorate it like tonight or tomorrow. And it comes with its nice little, its own little uh, cover. No, it doesn't. It just dips into it. Yeah, it, that's the way it came. Oh my. It's like a cover. So some of this is, there's little specks of white in there, but that's all right. All right, so here it is, and it comes with its own little tray or cover, and it's just going to sit out in the porch till tomorrow. All right, friends, I'm going to start on something else now. Let's get the bag. Well, I don't want to use that great big bag. I'm going to say I'm making a pretzel jello cheesecake sort of thing, and I got this from Natasha's kitchen too. There you are again. Have you guys been drinking or what? So I need to crush two cups of two cups. I wonder if that's two cups. rolling pin and you don't do it right till it's smithereens. Oh I gotta pre the oven again. Keep going me. Where is my 
is my red thing. What am I using? Oh, there's compost sitting in it. For crying out loud. What else can I use? Well, what else can I use? I gotta find something. All right, so I have half a cup of butter in here, quarter cup of sugar. What else do I put in there? Oh, pretzels. I'm just waiting for that butter to melt. And then I'll add two cups of crushed pretzels. So what else do I gotta do? I made one box of Jello. It's not, it's certainly not solid yet, but you're supposed to make it first so it gets to room temperature. Um, and then I gotta put, how much sugar was it? Yeah, fourth cup. Then I gotta add a thing of cream cheese, half a cup of sugar, beat until beautifully fluffy, and then fold in eight ounces of Cool Whip. But after the, yeah, I'm getting all ours backwards. So I gotta melt the butter, the sugar, put the pretzels in, mix it all together, put it in the baking sheet that I'm gonna actually put it in. Instead of having one big sheet, I'm gonna have two little casserole dishes. And then I have the oven preheated at 350. We bake it for 10 minutes. Take it out, bring it to room temperature. So, yeah. I'll probably put it out in the porch so it cools faster. And then we add the cream cheese frosting, or mix, mix, you know, on top of the pretzels. let that sit spread over pretzels put in the fridge for 30 minutes I'll put it out in the porch because it's cold out there and then we slice the strawberries and add it to the jello which will be at room temperature by that time As you know it takes a few hours for jello to sit up and then you put that over top of your cream cheese pretzel mixture and that's it so you could top it with whipped cream when you go to eat it, or not, whatever you want to do. So, never made this before. This is a half a cup thing. So I need two cups. That's one cup. Not right now, thanks. Get TV out of here, please. I'm dealing with a lot of food. So, just mix this up. It smells like popcorn, actually, with that the pretzel and the butter. Getting hot. Let's go to it. Forget. I gotta check if I'm supposed to spray the thing. Yeah, you don't do anything. You just add it to the pan. <coughs> so, oh. she did it in one nine by thirteen. I'm not doing that. <laughs> I'm doing this. I'll do this, and then I'll see if I can do that. That's so hot. I don't want to set that right on there. All right. Ooh. Well, maybe I'll, oh, I don't know. I don't know. Violet, what am I supposed to do? Just making sure that there's crust all over. The oven's preheated to 350 now. Oops. 
All right, that was my husband. Set the timer for 10 minutes. Now what do I gotta do? What do we gotta do? I should take out some of those strawberries to defrost because we add that to the jello. God, I hope I do this okay. One pound, well, jeepers. I'm just going to do a bowl full and hope that does it. I mean, what you going to do? Okay, now what do I have to do? Cream cheese. Oh, I need to get those beaters out of the dishwasher. Did you guys see? The did you guys see those dots out there on the ground? A whole bunch of them. Whole bunch of them. Yeah. They're too big to get to the feeder, but they're eating the stuff off the ground, so. I actually have a cooling rack over here. I'm going to start working on supper. It's going on 4 o'clock, I think. <clears throat> All right, so I have the two things right there. I have one block of cream cheese and half a cup of sugar in here. Oh, Tracy, just get it right the first time. Oh, still. So we need to beat this until it's beautiful and fluffy and then fold in eight ounces of Cool Whip, which is about a quarter of that tub. So, oh, plug your ears. I don't know what it's supposed to look like when it's light and fluffy. But that was probably four or five minutes, maybe. And then we're supposed to fold in. It's supposed to look like icing. It kind of looks like icing. I don't know. Beat it in, fold it in. Spread over the pretzel things and let it cool for 30 minutes. So I'll set this out in the porch and hope to high heaven this works. If not, I'll have to do it over again or scrap it. it smells good though. And she used like a little, you know how I use it. Oh, look at that. Uh, scoop, how I do my potatoes. So that's what I'm gonna do. What do you need, Mace? You're hungry, I'm gonna, once I'm done this, I'm gonna start working on the supper. Okay, don't mess with the gate. All right, let me move this. Now, I don't know whether I'm supposed to wait. Well, these are room temperature. Oh, I can touch it. God. I hope that comes out. You know how sugar can get. I don't know if you can. I'll show you in a minute.
don't know. Oh, I can't pick that up. I'm hoping. Here's hoping. Ooh. Like that, and then I'm going to try to spread it around. Get it all around if possible. I should have did more. But I'll just be prepared next time. If the kids like this and I make it, I'll have a proper pan like she did. But the good thing about these, these both have lids, so I won't have to fuss too much. trying guys I'm trying I want to make I want to make another thing when my husband gets home he got everything that I wanted I'll make another kind of chocolate cheesecake minis with or maybe strawberry I don't know what I'm doing yet I don't know whether I will but if he got fresh strawberries Mally's gonna be dipping some in chocolate all right, that's about as good as I can get it. Maze, you want to lick the bowl? It's whipped cream. He's there at the door. is working on that oh look at that bowl I'm gonna shred up these two cheese blocks in my food processor all right it's 10 after 4 I'm either having a hot flash or I don't know what's going on but whew, I just went outside for a second like this and it's friggin freezing out but it felt heavenly Mally's making herself an egg and heating up the taco meat all at the same time. Two separate pans, of course. I said, when you're done your egg, let me know and I'll come out and finish getting supper ready for these guys. And um, I have the pretzel things cooling out in the porch. And we'll finish that after I give the kids supper. Then I can... Oh, the dishwasher's done too. So i got to let that to cool down because I cannot deal with that right now. All right, guys. The... Uh... Taco meat's heated up. Mally has two delicious looking friggin' eggs right there, I can tell you. I forgot to heat these up in the oven. I wonder if I can just do it in the microwave. Oh, they're not very big. I've got your off skewer all day. I'm gonna just put them on a plate in the microwave and see if that works. I grated up that cheese. Here. I did the two blocks. I'm not going to use two blocks tonight, but I know I'll end up using it for something. So this way I don't have to dirty my food processor again. Get going, Misha. They're all hovering around the door. It's driving me insane. Don't they know? Don't they know? But here's the sauce that came with it. 
Oh, I'm gonna go holler to Mazai to take Violet out for a pee. Just a minute. Yeah, if I had been thinking, I would have got um, lettuce today. I wasn't thinking, obviously, but that's okay. So, I'll get some plates. a lot more floppy. Floppy. Put a little cheese down. not back yet so I'll see what he comes back with and what else I can tinker with and then when I'm all done Mally can decorate the heck out of whatever I've made so that will work good. Maze! He just wants meat and cheese he doesn't want anything else on it. I'll give him a spoon just because you know that's gonna be falling all over. See at the sock shelf? That you want your salsa on it? No. <coughs> okay. Misha. What do you want on your tacos? Um, I have salsa and like the taco sauce. Um, I want. <coughs> oh, and actually, there might be sour cream in the fridge. Um, okay. How are we gonna have? Well, I'm just doing two for now because I want to make sure everybody has some. And I want cell cream and the taco stuff. Okay. You got it, Pontiac. Yeah. It's cold out there, so I. You got a one? Should get me some water, please. I got a tickle in my throat. That Wait. happened to me like two seconds ago. All right. So I'm just gonna cut the tip. There you go. Uh, do you want to make it? Misha's. Yes. Put your Because <clears throat> I want everything. I know she will. <clears throat> Are you having some of this too, Mally? Yeah. Oh, good. Just double checking. Do you think because I need eggs? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you could put my egg right in it, honestly. That would be crazy. What do you I'll eat it? Hey, Misha. If you make a cupcake, can you go upstairs and get my avocados off my dresser? Mm -hmm. You have avocados up on your yeah, dresser? Too. What the heck's the matter with you? Nothing. Nothing. I'm sorry, I just went outside. I'm sorry, I just went outside, but Dad should be back any second now. What was that? He went into town. And some sour cream. I'm probably going to have some of this. I just won't put it in the wrap. Because I'm not? hungry. Taco sauce. No. Are you sure? We're tired of making those eggs. No, I didn't. It is one of the easiest things I know how to make. There. <clears throat> no, I'm good. Thank you. It's all right. I'll put a little meat to the side so Marquise and Kara can have theirs. And then.
there'll be enough around too if need be. Are you looking for the taco sauce? It's right here. Yeah. Me too. Right here. All right, I gotta empty this dang dishwasher so I can load it back up again. and I'll meet you back in a little bit. Alright, <laughs> right, everybody has their supper. This is some frozen sliced strawberries. And this is that yo yogurt. Where the heck did that come from? That's this jello. I mean, earlier. So you add it in there and then you add this on top of it like a layer so I don't know how this is going to turn out because I just don't know so the jello wasn't supposed to be firmed up yet I gotta make sure there's enough for this one Those strawberries around. I mean, hers look beautiful, of course, but you know. So they'll be like the crunchy, sugary, salty pretzels at the bottom, the fluffy. Cool whippy cream cheesy middle, and then the jelloy, tangy, strawberry e top. This certainly has more strawberries than that, but that's okay. I'm not gonna fuss with it because they'll probably pick them off anyways. But there we go. All right, so we'll probably top this with whipped cream or something. I'm gonna put the lids on it, put it out in the porch until tomorrow. By that time, the jello should be solid. Should be, fingers crossed. But of course, hers was all layered, but whatever. All right, my dogs are friggin' barking, I can tell you. It's five o'clock right on the nose. My husband got back brought me a coffee, set the groceries out on the dining room table because we were busy here, so I'll show you. All right, I picked up these two lamps today when I was in town from a yard sale because we don't got enough lamps. So yeah, just ignore those. Got Misha a broom for her own room because she's in the middle of transforming that. So now she has her own broom. Hip hip hooray. Got these slippers, I'm assuming for him maybe? I don't know, but slippers. Some more of those wraps. Friggin' Hershey's cookies and cream. This must be all be from the dollar store. Uh, popcorn, some resolve. This is an empty lemonade can. Then he went to superstore. Sea salt, malt, and vinegar chips. All dressed chips. Two things of tenders. Uh, strawberry cream cheese and strawberry cream cheese. A thing of whipped cream, two things of honey garlic sauce, some popcorn, which would have been from the dollar store, two things of strawberries. He must have got those at Sobeys. Did you get the strawberries at Sobeys? Mar? Oh, he has headphones on. Um, unless they put more out in a lemon um, and Oreo cookies. That was going to be for something. 
But I am going to have my coffee now because I need it. And we're going to continue working. Oh, that's not tenders. That's wings. Is that tenders? No, this is wings. Okay. Oh, wings. I guess tonight's a Super Bowl. I'm, I don't even understand the game of football. But the halftime shows and commercials are good. I'm sure the game is too. I just don't get it. I'm just going through the scribbler. I just used the scribbler. Oh. Oh, geez. That's the strawberry cake. That's the shortcake. That's not hard to make, biscuits, yeah. Yeah, I think I went over that. This is the pretzel thing I made. And then I forget which channel. I'll have to look at that, which one this is. I know it's not Natasha's Kitchen. It's something else, but I'll find it. No bake mini cheesecakes. Uh, I imagine these are super sweet because um, you make them in cupcake trays in liners and you spray the liners, mix graham crumbs with sugar uh, and soft butter. But I got honey made. I think these are sweetened already. For some reason, I think it's sweetened. So I'm going to taste a little bit just to see because I'm, I'm not going to make this more sweet than it needs to be. But five tablespoons of butter melted butter, mix it. So that's the base. And then the innards, um, two eight ounce cream cheese, beat until fluffy, add sweet milk, a can of sweetened condensed milk. You know how sweet that is. One teaspoon of vanilla, three teaspoons of lemon juice. Um, she had lemon rind too, but I don't have, oh, I do have, but that's for Mally. She has a reason to have that. Mix it together. Pipe it into the cupcake things with a liner bag, or if you want, and then leave it overnight. I'm going to do this, but I'm going to add some cocoa powder to make it sugary, or er, sugary, chocolatey. And then the whipped cream that I'm going to put on top will be, let me just think. There'll be whipped cream on top, and I'll put a uh, strawberry on top of that, maybe? I don't know. I haven't decided yet. So I want to do those tonight so they can sit overnight. And I want to do the shortcake biscuits. So I need to get on the ball with that. But I need to do this first. This is this is my priority right now. I need it. All right, friends. Watch out, Violet. I don't know if I'm even going to get to that. Those biscuits. I mean, I can easily whip those up tomorrow morning. All right, so here's cupcake liners. Did I spray that one? I didn't spray that one. Sprayed. Oh, I need the graham cracker crumbs and five tablespoons of butter and sugar. How much? Oh, just a tablespoon of sugar, but I gotta see how many graham crumbs. It doesn't say how many graham crumbs. I already didn't write it down. I'm just gonna wing it. no bake right like I don't have to bake anything I'm just gonna do it all and if I don't use it all I don't use it all oh I forgot to even taste yeah, I think that's sweetened it only says like one extra tablespoon of sugar needs a little more butter I think maybe just a little bit dang it Yeah, yeah. And 
then I think they, this is probably way more crumbs than we need, but that's all right. <clears throat> oh, I am going to sleep so hard tonight. That didn't melt it. Let's give it a minute. Oh, that doesn't sound good. that together it smells good Are you making cupcakes for no I'm not making cupcakes well, why is it cupcake? I'm making cheesecake things let me go on out I'm too tired to deal with all that yeah this will have to do and she said only like a tablespoon in the bottom of each thing. I'll do that one tray and depending on how many innards I have left, I don't know. So, one tablespoon you say, huh? Oh. We're going to have way more food than we need tomorrow, but it's a holiday. So, go big or stay home. Just doesn't seem like very much. So if they're jumping around, I can hear. So, and then she just used the back of her measuring cup to pack it down. Why you spray them and she said you gotta leave it overnight or for a very long time more than four to six hours because it's the taking the paper off even though it's been four to six hours oftentimes it crumbles when you take the paper off so I'm not gonna need these till tomorrow after lunch anyway so that's a long time to set this and there's still quite a bit of stuff there but let me get another bowl oh yeah I might be done after this and I'll do those biscuits for the strawberry shortcake tomorrow because it's been a long day hasn't it Violet I think Violet was mad at me most of the day because usually she's down around my ankles all day. But since I went to town and I didn't take her with me, she was upstairs with the kids. And I'm just like, I bet you anything she's mad at me. No doubt about what time is it? It's 5.44 now. I drank my coffee. She recommended Philadelphia cream cheese, but I'm using no name use it what I got and this was on sale and oh just a minute guys 
All right. Get this open. What else do I do? Oh, beat until fluffy and then add a can of sweetened condensed milk, some vanilla, lemon juice, and put it in a piping bag. Well, she, you don't have to, you can scoop it in, but to make it neater, put it in a piping bag. I don't know how to do that stuff. That's what Mally does. I can do it. I shouldn't say I don't know how. I'm usually just too lazy to do that, but I might try it today. Maybe. This and this can go in the fire. Just because it's the garbage. All right, so I gotta beat this until it's fluffy. All right. Just break it up a little bit. All right, I'll be back. All right. Okay. So that's beaded, it seems fluffy to me. Add sweet milk. 10-4, good buddy. This stuff is so sweet. And a bit of vanilla. Spoon. Oh. About a splash. Try to get that all out. that and now she didn't do it with cocoa but I want to add a little cocoa to this because this is very similar to like the other cheesecake thing so I should have something chocolatey we'll try that I need a spatula to scrape down those sides see it's all what do you think, Violet? Huh? Making an awful racket, aren't I? Well, I can't help it. All right, let's try this without blowing smoke everywhere. I forgot lemon juice. I don't have real lemon juice, but I do have this. One of those little how much do I add? Three teaspoons. There. This might have to go a little longer. Yeah. Yeah. Hers was a little stiffer. So. Tastes good. All right, let's try this. Well, it's not falling so much like the first time, so it must be good enough. That's delicious. Not keto at all, but friggin' delicious. All right, I've got one of those bags. See if I can scoop it in. I don't want too many. I just grabbed whatever tip. That doesn't sound appropriate. Get your minds out of the gutters. I was supposed to cut that before I put it in. 
I don't know how to do this stuff. I don't really care because I just want it to not go all over the pan. Yeah, this isn't like so deep chocolate, but there's a bit of chocolate flavor. It's like that creamy chocolate. God, I hope this works. Of course, leave it to me to try all brand new recipes. Well, no, nah, I made that cake last year and that strawberry cheesecake. But... Ooh. another cupcake tin. All right, it's 11 after six. I got the dishwasher going. I'm just tidying up the kitchen, but so I got 18 of those little cheesecakes. I'm going to put them, cover them with saran, put them out in the porch till tomorrow. And there was enough left over for two wine glass ones. So yeah, anyways, I'm going to wipe the table off and Mally can get doing the do, whatever she's going to do. And yeah, I'll be back. All right, so I just want to show you the before of the strawberries that Mally's going to dip. A whole bunch of chocolate right there. Yeah. All right, friends, I'm going to end this video. This is a super long one, and I apologize, but I know you guys, some of you really don't mind long videos, but it's a very important day. We had a good day playing with the birds and prepping for tomorrow's Valentine's Strawberry Social. So by the time you see this, it'll probably be Valentine's. So happy Valentine's. But I just got done watching the halftime show, and I thought it was phenomenal. I really, really enjoyed it. But maybe not everybody will, but I thought it was great. But anyways, I'm going to end this because I still got some stuff to do tonight, which will probably be on tomorrow's video. So, yeah. Yeah, but thanks for hanging out with me, listening to me jibber-jabber and get some stuff done. Fingers crossed that stuff turns out okay. Yeah, Mally decorated the cake. I will show you tomorrow. Did the strawberries. I'll show you tomorrow. And, yeah, we're going to have a good old tea party. So you're more than welcome to pop back and spend Valentine's with us because I'd love for you to. So, anyways, I'm going to say peace, love, and happiness today and every single day. Please like, share, and subscribe if you so choose. But if not, that's okay too. I still love you. I still want all the happiness in the world for each and every one of you out there. I certainly do. I really, really honest and truly do. Yes, I do. So, all right, guys. With that, I'm going to say have a good night or have a good morning. And I will see you tomorrow. Bye. Boink.